Bowlers are underway. Welcome. Match 13. This is the U.S. Invitational from Lita Lanes in Nashua, New Hampshire. Paul Grant along with Bob Lee. Thanks for joining us. This is match four of five. We've seen some good ones today. All play on the right from Belfast, Maine. Universal screening on the left. Rick Pomeroy leads off for them with a 10 box. And the eight to start off for Anthony Iannuzzi. Anthony with a 112 average from Winthrop, Mass. Rick Pomeroy. Belfast Maine with a 110 average. Second box, first string. It's a two pin lead early for all play. You know their records, they have 12 win points. Mm -hmm. I'm sure the record is. Yeah, Universal's uh, te won 10 out of 12 today. Uh, they're up to 18 wins. They're two from the bottom of the standings, but uh, we're, this, is a, this will be a great match. Okay, second ball for both bowlers here. First of two strings. That's gone. Yeah. On. First mark. Nathan Iannuzzi. 18 in the ball after two. Eight box for Pomeroy. 18 after two. So dead even right. Dead even right now. And Iannuzzi got a spare though for Universal screening. Here comes Paul Dyer from Belfast Green also. 112 league average. On the right for all play. Steve Vaughty on the left from Lynn Mass with a 112 league average. To shake hands, good sportsmanship. Paul the lefty. On 36, first ball. Off to the left. Get six though. That'll fall. Body on the head pin. Wow, five seven ten. Ooh. Five seven ten. The reward for hitting the head pin. Spare bid won't go off the head pin. A dire. Miss all of it. Dire. Eight box. Eight after one. Body first box. He gets eight also after one. No blood. 26 all. Early going. First two bowlers. Get one more match after this. Lost track. <laughs> Here we go. Paul Dyer, second box, first string. The horseman right, seven pin in the left. Steve Bonnie, second box, first string. Back door. Five. Oh, oh hey, for the screen of Paul Troy. Bonnie has some wood to help him here. Takes his time. Looks in. Delivers. Oh, my oh, goodness. Oh, leaning on the getter. Won't go. Ken Paul Dyer, 18 after two for the ball play. Good bid by Body. Steve with a 10. 18 after two. 36 apiece. Two four boxes. Third ball is coming up with five. Cliff Walker on the right from Bridgeton, Maine with a 108 league average. He'll be up against Lou Garchana from Chelsea, Mass. 115 league average. Universal screening in the red. Black meter points for all play. Lou's been side. making some noise on the Pro Series. Gets a six fill, six shot rather than his first ball. First three. Lou Charna. Five drop. One mark on the board so far for Universal Screening. Nothing for all play yet. Cliff goes to the left there. First scare bid. Got two. Walker for an out. It's two. Eight boxes start first. Shana, miss it. Seven box, one pin lead. Make it two pin lead. Small play. 44 42 early on. First of two at the U.S. Invitational here in Needle Lane, Nashville, New Hampshire. That's one. 
It's, I thought it was one. Yep. It's just two up there. Trust, trust your eyes. Watch the bowling. One five punch. Shauna missed the head pin. He gets seven. Cliff saying, I hit the head pin. I get two. So we can work it out here. Good shot. Up three. Sean has the one, two, and the ten. He's off to the left, though. And big out. Eight. Sixteen at the two. A pair of eights for Cliff Walker for all play. Sean with an eight also. He's at fifteen at the two. A one pin lead. All play. 52-51. Here's Dom Drake from Bangor, Maine, 116 league average for all play on the right. He'll be first here. Corrado Pani from Revere on the left for universal screening with a 115 league average. First box, first string of two. On the head pin. Oh! Gets nine. Same position, same spot, will get a spare. Corrado on the head pin, he gets nine. Over! Leaving up the three pin. Break for the spare. No. Missed it. Oh, it came back. Oh, that was unexpected. Came back. Missed it totally. Ball came out of nowhere. And a matching spare for Pony. Ten plus after one for both. One pin lead for all play. All plays a bowling alley in Arcade and Belfast, Maine. 17 teams competing for 10 playoff spots tomorrow. Wrapping up the championship on Saturday here at Leader Lanes in Nashua at the U.S. Invitational. The winning team will get $8,000 to split. On the spare, he's off to the left. It's the Clary, five belt, 15 after one. Pony on the head pin, five also, 15 after one. Good pitch the spare, won't go. Universal, Universal screening won uh, 10 out of the first 12 today. Good try by Pony, won't go. They're, uh, they're up to 18 and... Uh, 10 box for Drake. Actually, 25 after two. And then nine for Pani. He's at 24 after two. Sorry, Excuse box. me, they were 10 and eight. So uh, they're up to uh, 18 and 54. Come on now. I think all play just has 12 points. They're on the outside looking in right now in the playoff spot. As is universal screening. So six points is big for either team. 77-75, two pin lead for all play early on in the first. Anchor ball to Al Nelson. Left side, Justin Scally. Al's a former, uh, a top bowler out of Maine. Uh, 20 years ago, was uh, he, had, he, had a, he was one of the top bowlers in New England. Currently the 110 average of Augusta, Maine. Missed it. Continue on, Bob, sorry. No, he can, you just watch for him to, he's gonna be warming up today. Chance for a strike. And Justin, we see all over the place in Massachusetts. That was for a spare, actually. Missed it. Ten for Al Nelson. And a ten also for Justin Scally. 87-85, two pin lead for all play. First of two strings here at Lee Lanes in Nashua. U.S. Invitational. All plays uh, team average was 527 yesterday, and uh, universal screening was coming in at an average of 541. Yes, the Clary, five hit. Scally off to the right, it's three. Open boxes here, full bullets, second box, first string. The anchor, Al Nelson, trying to get the spare. Off to the left, gets two. Justin Scally, off to the left. Keeps the 1-6-10. 
now with the one, two, and nine remaining. Third ball, second box, first string. Gets eight, 18 after two for Al Nelson for all play, and nine for Justin Scally. He's at 19 after two. It's a one pin lead early on, 95 94 in favor of all play. Back to the top of the order, he'll switch sides. Anthony Iannuzzi, the only spare so far in the match, the only walk in the match. 18 in the ball, starting off here on 36 on the right, the blue shirt. Out of Winthrop, Massachusetts, 112 league average. On a spare. Head pin hit gets eight. Leaves a six and ten. Gives him a seven pin lead. Big Pomeroy. No pass pin, 110 league average. Clips the 10 pin in this first ball on open, ball, open box. Get 18 in this first two. For another spare, gets it! Ianuzzi, Ianuzzi, two in a row. 36 in the ball after three. Good comeback by Pomeroy in that second shot. One, two, and nine pin remaining. Gets two, nine box. 27 after three, gets a 10, eight, and nine. 27 after three for Rick Pomeroy for all play. So now Universal Screening right now is up by 8, 112, 104, and they'll add on here as Anthony is on his second spare in a row. 36 in the ball here, heading into the fourth. First string of two. On the spare, on the head pin, six. 42 after three. Pomeroy trying to come back. Favorable hit after missing the head pin. Has the one, three, and the seven. Time for three in a row. Up one. Pomeroy missed it in the middle. Eight box up there. And yeah, nice ten there for Rick Pomeroy. Ianuzzi is at 50 after four. Rick Pomeroy 37 after four. It's a 12 pin lead, 126 to 114 in favor of Universal Screening. Second boxes, second box. Third and fourth boxes for the second Third bowlers. Fourth. Yes. That's what I meant to say. I just made the same mistake on the graphic. Uh, Paul Dyer on the left now. Steve Boxing on the right. For the two dead woods and both doubles. Steve Boxing on a limb, 112 league average. He had 8 and a 10 to start, 18 up to 2. Same for Paul Dyer. Head pin hit, nets him only 4, 5. Nice ball! One for a strike, it's 9, leaving up the 9 pin. Perfect piece of wood here for Paul Dyer for all play. Body trying to kick the three oh, over, nice gets two. Paul Dyer for a spare. Oh, missed he it! Got it. Got it. Wood came back and got it, missed it initially. He kicked initially. Initially. He kicked it in the shins. And a nine for Steve Body. Body is at 27 after three. And with the spare, Paul Dyer is at 28 and the ball after three. It's a one pin lead right now for 11. Universal Screening. 11. 11 rather, 11. And all the boxes are open, so ball play will cut into the lead here. Possibly on 35 in a minute. All right, make it a five pin lead. Six pin spare fill, 34 up to three now for Paul Dyer. Body has the wood there to help him. Going for the tip left, maybe, or he goes to the right yeah. side, missed it all. Would you go for the right side or the left I, side? I like what he was thinking with the, the tip there. Spamping gets it again. Oh, all day. Two in a row. 44 in a ball after four for all play. Eight blocks for Steve Watson. He's at 
35. 35 after four. Lead is three now. In favor of universal screening. But all play has one spare on the board. When Paul Dyke is back up in the fifth box. Luren Gasharna for Universal now on 36. He had a seven, a seven and an eight to start. 15 after two. Cliff Walker on the left side. Trying to get one to fall in the corner. No. Cliff had two eights for a 16 for the first two. Gachana trying to kick those three over to the 10 pin. Oh! Nice shot for Gachana. And the wood won't go. Trying to get the ball to carry over to the 10 pin. Wouldn't go. Gachana at 25 in the ball. That's a three. Cliff Walker in the gutter. Nine. 25 after three. Lead is four. Four pin lead right now for Universal Screening. Take that, 14. Strike on spare. 35 up to 3, 45 and a ball to 2. No doubt about that one. Huge strike for Kachana. Universal screening in the lead now. Cliff Walker has a tough split. Try to salvage 2 here on the third ball coming up. It's one, eight blocks, 33 up to four. It's eight, uh, let's see, 173, 16. 157. 16 is the lead right now. Universal screening on a strike, all play on a spare down the road. Dorado Pani from Revere on the right, Universal screening. Don Drake from Bangor, Maine on the left on 35 for all play. Open box is here. Gets the head pin to fall. Gets eight out of that, but he'll have a split. He'll have the two on the left, the ten pin on the right. Right for a straight pin. Five won't go. Tommy at 25, a spare five and a ten. Nice try by Pony, won't go. Pony at 24 in his first two, and there's a spare for Dom. 35 and a ball after three for all play. Pony, 10 bucks. 34 after three. 16 pins is the lead right now. But Dom Drake is on spare for all play on 35. Corrado, Pony. Red shirt on 36. 34 after 3, and there's 4 blocks in the first string of 2. Goes to left, gets 4. John Drake, 44 in a ball here. On the fill, goes left, gets 5. Not bad. 34 after 3. Sorry, that's not adding up yet. Get that sword a minute. Snowboard slow. Pony coming back. Six pin won't go for the spare. Drake misses. He has a 40 after three with that spare five. Pony for a 10. Gets it. John Drake only gets a six there. Pony at 44. Lead should be 15 now. 46 for John Drake. Sorry, Bob, what was that? The lead is 15 now. 15 in favor of all play. Same team. No, no. Since I can't see it. Universal yet. screening at 193. It's so much easier in your eyes. I know, just keep track of it in your head. You know, if they were ahead by 11 before, they gained four, because four were left on the plate, so that's a 15 pin difference. All right, anchor bullets here. Justin Scally on the right. Oh, nice ball there. Oh, oh my! Nice Justin Scully of Boxborough. Oh, Al Nelson left, trying to match him and get 6-6 six, six drop. 
29 plus 2 for Scali. For universal screening. Now Nelson for all play. Trying to get a spear here on 35. Missed it to the left, gets one. Nine blocks. 27 after three for Al. Scali on a strike here. Boxborough, Massachusetts, next to Acton. On a strike on 36. Look at a double! Eight in the first ball. Al Nelson, Al Nelson trying to get the board here. He's open the first three. Gets a split. He's a six pin on the right. Two, four, seven on the left. Justin for Spare gets it! Without the wood. Spare on strike. And the lead is 26. 49 the ball up to four for Justin Scally from Universal Speeding. Nelson trying to kick it over and missed it totally. Missed it again, six blocks, 33 up to four for Al Nelson. 30 pin lead, 223 and 193. Universal screening in control. We have a strike and a spare in hand, one spare in hand for all play. The advantage goes to universal screening. Plenty of time left here. Top of the order again. Rick Pomeroy for all play. And 37 in his first four goes wide for four. Anthony Ayanuzzi on the head, 10, strike bid gets nine. 50 after his first four so far, he's in the fifth box of the first of two strings. Pomeroy missed the second shot. Here's a spare bid for the 10 pin, right on it. 16 of all for Anthony. Universal screen, the lead increases. Rick Pomeroy gets a nine, 46 after five. Looking for his first mark on 36. Anthony Ayanuzzi has three marks now in the string. Armory goes left. Gets five. Strike on spare. Strike on spare, sorry. <laughs> sorry folks, missed that one. 10 bucks of Pomeroy, 56 up to 6. Strike on spare for Anthony Iannuzzi. Nine, he's at 80 and a ball for 6. Ball die on the right side for off point, 36. Working on the mark here. Bonte on the left, open box. On the spare, off to the right, flips the 10 pin for one fill. 45 after four. Bonte with a full horseman right. Here's the shot he wanted in the spare fill. Gotta get 10 on his next box, next ball. Bonte looking for the spare for Universal. Just missed the head pin, will come back. Not quite. Paul Dyer, 55 after 5. Steve trying to get a 10, gets it to 45 after 5. It's a 40 pin lead, is it? It's like 40 pin lead right now for Universal Screening. Paul Dyer, first ball, gets the clear. Steve Body off to the left side. 
Six four in the first ball. This is to the right. It's two. Steven is second ball. Six blocks in the first three. Nice shot. Will it go? Not quite. Kingpin left up. Seven for Paul. 62 after six. Steve looking for 10 here. Now give him 55 after six. He makes it. Nope, 54 after six. 272, 230. 30, 42 pin lead. 42 pin lead for Universal Screening. Wow. And they've got three marks on the board still. It's not for all play. So they're running away early now. Third balls are up. Cliff Walker on the right. For all play. Punch through, Spread Eagle. Can't catch a break here. 33 in his first four. Luka Chana on a, working on a strike here. Six in the first ball. 45 coming into this plus the strike ball. Does his work? It's the three left side. Lou trying to turn it around, gets seven on the strike. 52 after four. Cliff going for a 10 after getting a spread eagle, gets eight. 40, even 41. 41 after five. Eight blocks for Kachana. 60 after five. 287 to 238. It's a 49, is it? 49. 49 pin lead. According to the scoreboard, we'll check on the accuracy there. They've got another spear on the way too. Cliff punches the uh, half twist to right. Sean punches half twister plus one. Second ball. Big comeback. Left the seventh in. Sean on 35. Second ball. Nice bid. He leaves the 10 pin up. Two good shots by both bowlers, won't go. Well, we have to check the scores if they're all right. Yeah, if, if you could. It, 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 if, yeah, if something gets different, we will announce it that way. 51 <laughs> after five. Kachana with the 10, he's at 70 after five, a six rather. And 51 after six for Cliff Walker. 297 to 248 remains at 49. Pin lead for Universal Screening. Both teams desperately needing, needing points to get in the playoffs. Ten teams out of 17 qualify. Top two getting buys tomorrow. Ani looking good in that ball, but only gets five. Four bowlers here. John Drake just missed the object pin there. Tough leave anyway. Dom at 46 after four. And an eight box, 54 after five. Ani at 44 in his first four. This is seven box, 51 after five. 304, 256, 48 is the lead. For Universal screening. Don Drake trying to get his team. I lost track. That's a clearing. So four up for who? For Honey, on the head pin. What's two and two? Four more. The, sco the scoreboard is wrong. All, all plays should have four more pins than, than reflected on the scoreboard. Yeah, two six fouls. I'll take it a minute for you. So, uh, lead is 44 now. I pick up this tough shot. Oh, just missed the seven pin for the spare. Gave it a good try. Both going for uh, the third box. Ball for the uh, box. There's a 10 for Drake, 64 for 6, and Pani with a 9, even 60 up for 6. 313 to 270 with the update, 43 pin lead. 
universal screening. First of two strings. Our fourth match today out of five. We'll go over again tomorrow, 9 a.m. Saturday, 9 a.m. Yeah, I get it. Tomorrow and Look, later on in the day we'll play off Saturday. Championship matches on Saturday. Anchor ball is up. Al Nelson on the right for all play. Good hit in the head. Pan, he gets a strike. Seven and ten went down simultaneously. Off, Gally. There you go. Meanwhile, Justin Scout over up. Gets a seven ten split. Over to carom that wood on the ten pin over to the wall and get the seven pin. This would be something if we can make it. Oh, oh no, ball from right Kelly. behind it. Good try though by Justin. Al Nelson, first mark for 43 plus two up to five. Justin Scally at that mark at 57 up to five, and he's at 67 now up to five. A spear and strike. Now that 10, 67 after 5. Sample. 51 pin lead right now. On the strike for Nelson. Tough split. Scali, back door 7. One out of 3 and 6 pin piece of wood in front. On the side. Now trying to figure out how to play this shot on 36. Difficult spare here. Off to the right. Try to slide it over, didn't go. And a nice spare there for Justin Scally. 77 in the ball at the six. Gets it, 61. After six, 241, 294 to 241. Add four to all play score. So it's a 43 pin lead. 43 pin lead. Universal screening up in the first ring. Top of the order now. Anthony Hayanuzzi on fire. And a spare and then a strike. Working the strike here. Number two! Ten pin leads. Won't go. Good Pomeroy on the left. One, two, four, and ten pin. Open box pin. We had 56 after six. For another spare! Missed it. We got a. Oh, what a shot by Good Pomeroy for a spare! They needed that one. And he wasn't there for Anthony. With the nine box up to 98 after seven. Pomeroy at 66 in the ball after seven. For all play. Anthony off the head pin. Gets seven though. On the spare, Pomeroy, looks good. Sweeping, rolling, nine on the fill. 75 after seven now. Chance for another one, two in a row, hopefully. Yeah. Oh, good try by Anthony, couldn't get it over to the seven. Man. For another spare, missed it to the left. Ouch. Ten for Anthony. And now he gets to ten. Anthony Ayanuzzi up to 108 after eight. Rick Pomeroy at 85 after eight. I have it at 42 pins now officially. Universal screening up by 42 in the first string. Steve Bocci on the right. Universal screening now. Paul Dyer on the left. All play. Body 54 after six. Back door is the one ten pin. Paul Dyer. That's the five. That's the Clary. He had 62 after six. 
He got it. He got it. He got it. Nice shot by Steve Body. And right back. Oh. Oh. Just missed his Paul Dyer. Steve Body with a spare is at 64 and a ball through seven. Right for 10. Won't go. 71 left in the nine watch. Should be a 43 pin lead plus this next ball from Steven. 71 through 7 now for Paul Dyer from Belfast, Maine. On the spare fill. Off to the left gets the Clary. 5 fill. 69 after 7 now. There's a nice shot there by Paul Dyer. There, but the wood is a little tricky here. Oh! On the head pin, you get three. First there, hooked it to the right. Wow. That hurts. Third ball for Steve. Pick your favorite pin. Just one for nine. Puts my 78 through eight, and at eight. For Paul Dyer, 80 after 8. What's the lead now, uh, Bob? I'm double checking. It's uh, 345 for all play and 393 for universal screening. 48. That's what the scoreboard shows, so, and that's what our graphic shows. So we're all right. Uh, Luke Chana on the right side, punches 3. Open boxes for both bowlers here. Do it a 70 even through six. 51 through six coming in for Cliff Walker. Bichana on the oh. pin. Makes a bid for a spare. Leaving up to five and a seven pin. Cliff Walker. I pick this up. What a shot for a spare. That's a tough one to make. Got it. Wow. 61 of the ball through seven for Cliff Walker and nine for Luke Chana. 79 after seven. Leads at 47. Minus this ball coming up for all play. Universal still has a spare on their board coming up. Justin Scali does. He comes up as the anchor. Chana, head pin hit. Oh, they're close. On the spare. Gets five. 16 6 now from seven. Cliff Walker. Blue looking for the triangle for the spare. We use the wood. No. Oh. Eight pin in the back. Went right at it. Cliff for a difficult shot for a spare. Can't roll the wood over. Box for Luke Chana. 89 after 8. And 8 for Cliff Walker. He's at 74 after 8. First string of two here, our fourth of five matches today. At the U.S. Invitational at Lee Lanes in Nashville, New Hampshire. Paul Grant along with Bob Lee. Fourth ball is coming up here. Brought up Pani. Give me just a minute. Don Drake on the left side. Start again, nine, 9 o'clock. It's actually a delay on 35. The sweeper's stuck. The sweeper is stuck, rather. We'll do this again tomorrow morning, 9 a.m. here from Lita Lanes in Nashua. The same thing Saturday. Team competition and playoffs tomorrow. And then the finals on Saturday.
Top team winning $8,000 to split. Hani is there just waiting for the uh, Cali 35 to get fixed. Four twelve to three sixty eight right now is the score. Forty four pin lead. The universal screening. And they have a spare in hand as well. Scoreboard is correct now. They corrected it. You don't have to add the four then. Don't have to add the four. Let's fix our graph. 48, 48 now. Universal screening up by 48 plus a ball. This holiday season, please consider Canopin Bowling as a gift. Canopin gift cards. Check out the local Canopin Alley and support Canopin Bowling. Get our young ones involved. Can't let them gift cards to give them giving this holiday season. It's our third day of team competitions. As 35 is ready to go. So we'll get back underway now. It's quite a party. Started seven bucks. It's 64 in his first six. Don Drake had 60 in his first six. Oh. Six in that first ball. Seven, ten, and a Worcester. John, good ball there. Seven and nine ten left up. You can carry him that wood over. Right out for a spare. Can the wood push over? He did it! Nice shot there. Seventy plus the ball for Pawnee. Through seven. I'm going to try, but nothing going. Two for a 10. Missed it all. Eight marks. 72 after seven. Eight box, first string of two. Another delay on 35. Well, tell us about the uh, how the singles match went on Monday. Who won the singles match on Monday? That was Josh Daly. Uh, made his way all the way up. He, he, he uh, said he wasn't going to enter, and then he threw a 641 during qualifiers. He was in the top four and made his way all the way through. 32 bowlers for the knockout. Uh, you know, five, five wins. Uh, just dominated all, uh, really, in, in the end. He, he just threw a 106. He was playing the dummy team, and uh, he, he, threw, he had a low-scoring front first side in the low 40s, and put up a 106 back half to to win six against the wow. against the dummies. Wow. I, I was just talking to one of his teammates a moment ago. He's 21 years old and throws the ball 44 miles an hour, wow. and you know you, you can you can try to criticize it if you want, but he's. Uh, He's, he's learning more about the game every year. He's, he, he's dedicated to it. And uh, I think you know, he and I have had a couple conversations about uh, how some bowlers, and Tom Surrett was one of them, we talked, talked during a lane break at uh, on a Channel 5 show, that when he's angry, he just he just takes all that energy and focuses it on the lanes. And he, it, just, it just helps him concentrate, helps him. He, he has his best comebacks when, he, when he's... Uh, when he's pumped up, so he'll have to stay he'll have to stay angry the rest of his life, I guess, huh? Well, he's he's turning it into energy. He's, he's, he's putting you know you get butterflies in your stomach. You put those butterflies in a row, and you let them fight for you. All right, that should be good. Back in the way, Corrado Pani, the eight blocks in the first string. Off to the left gets five. John Drake trying to get all play back in play here. The first. Seven fill, by the way. It was a, 
think there was a five fill in there. Okay, yeah, I'm sorry, five. With seven blocks to finish with the 80 after eight for Karabahani. Don Drake with a 782 now after eight. So it's 424 to 380. It's a 44 to lead. The universal screening, the first, the two. Justin Scally working on a spare here. Knock the head pin, gets seven though. On the fill, 84 after six. Al Nelson on the left. Back drop, gets eight. That's the one in the eight pin standing. Scally looking for another spare here. Oh, good try. Now Nelson, one eight hit here with a spare. Missed it to the right. Scally for a ten. A, that was a thirty-four up there before. That's that ten. He's at ninety-four after seven. Nine for Al Johnson, 70 now for seven. 451 to 389. 62 pin lead all of a sudden, right? You read that right? That's what the scoreboard says. And I, I just checked the scoreboard during the during the uh, lane repairs. Now Nelson striking back with nine. Scally with a half whisker. Might come back here. Has five standing. Nelson, he's taking bird here. He does, spare. Eighty in a ball. After eight, Al Nelson. Oh my! Nice ball. That was for a ten. Ten blocks there for Skelly. One oh four now after eight. Four sixty one to three ninety nine. It's a sixty two pin lead. Universal screening. Total control here in the first. Back to the top of the order. Eighth and ninth, ninth and tenth box is coming up. One more screen to go after this. One more match to go after that. Rick Harmon okay, on the right. Punch through. Three. Yeah. 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 85 oh, the first eight is a strike kid. Ryan Uzi. First one away through eight so far. Coming to the ninth box. Rick punches out one there on the right. For a spare. Oh, oh, look, get all 118 of the ball. There you go. Universal pulling away. And another chop of one. Hey, ball, right here. Right here. Right. Five blocks. 90 up to nine. Five marks with string. High and easy. Trying to get the total closer. Punches out the triangle on the corner. Ayanuzi on a spare fill. There we go. There Looks we go, like eight. Oh, he moved that five oh, pin. Five balls went down to the left side for a strike. Conroy struggling here the last couple of boxes. It's a 10 for 100. He's got six left. His final shot. That won't go. He's at 126 after nine. Ends up with a seven for a 97 first time. There you go, good day, good. We got it. Good job, baby. Get the eye with a 136 oh. first string for Universal yeah, Screening. 136. Oh, what a string that was. He said it should have been a 150 to 160. That's the way it goes, though, but all averages out. Paul Dyer on the right, all play. Belfast, Maine. That's a lot of those. He punched out a lot. He had 80 after 8. Keep on to the left. That's the 4 7 10. He had 78 coming into the 9th box here. For a spare, 
Oh, good travel, go! He does! He swept the wood over from the left side. 88 the ball at the nine. Sensational shot by Steve Barty. Paul Dyer was an eight on the right. 88 to nine. 88 to nine. Paul Dyer last box for the first string. All three group try to get the second string. Both teams on the outside looking in for the playoffs right now. Top 10 qualify on 17. Another lane breakdown on 35. Paul will play off the string while they wait for 35 to get fixed. Best he can do is a 98 for the string. And he missed a 96 for the string. Our camera's breaking down too. Here we go, Stevie, baby. Uh, there you go, kid. Right on the head. 499 to 427. Commanding lead by 72. Universal Sweeney. <laughs> Cliff Walker on the right, ball play, third ball, 74 through 6, through 8 rather, 74 through 8. He flies to finish up first though with a delay. Mark Iyer went ahead and finished up while he played the 35 to get fixed. He has the clear, the 5 drop. That's Spearfield, he's at 93 after nine. Punch up the head pin. One for 100. Three, six, ten on the right, eight pin, left. Gets one for the even 100 for Steve Bonte for universal screening. 5, 11 to 4, 27. 84 pin lead. Total domination in the first string. Okay, Luke. Finish them up, Bruce. Okay, fourth ball is, uh, third ball is now Cliff Walker, Luke Achana. Seven drop for Cliff Walker. Triangle. Chana, Larry. Hey, you got a good page, Luke. Getting advice how to play this. Yeah, I think he's going to play the wood. I don't know. For a spare. Went for the wood, but no. Yes! Good. Yep. Took his time. A spare. Like he's at 84 in a ball through nine. Trying to get the total oh, down. Right on the head, buddy. Right on the head. Luka Nice out for a nine. It gives him 98 after nine. Help on nine, Luka. Help on nine, buddy. This wood in the gutter went uh, 36. Right back, up, on the head, clear that right wood. back on the head. Yeah, clear that wood first. They're going to play through it, though. He dropped. He's a six and ten. Good fill. Ninety-two up to nine. Kawan. Machana is the head pin, but gets six. One three six. One side seven pin left. And for a spare, he gets a two in a row. For Cliff Walker, trying to get some momentum for the team going into the third, the second, second and final string. He's at one hundred two now. One hundred two in the ball to finish up. Good try by Lou. 10 box will give him 108 for string number one. And that's a foul, so it won't count. Nine box, 107. Good job, buddy. Good job, Luke. Good job, Luke. 529 to 455. I have that at 74, minus this ball. Cliff Walker finishing up the string on a spare. Off to the left, gets five. Ends up with a 107. Strong finish for 
Cliff Walker after a slow start. 529 to 460. Sixty-nine is what we have. Fourth ball is now. Don Drake on the right for off play. Bangor Maine. Gets three in the corner. Trotter Pani in the red. Oh, buddy ball, buddy ball. Hit. Kick it over. He's up three. They keep it down, guys. Keep it down. Yeah. Yeah. No, 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 no. Don Drake at eight. That ain't happening. I keep it down to home and Maine. Not down here, baby. For the spare, you try too full. Again, Holly, you shouldn't be here. Exactly right. <laughs> Nothing to do with it for Corrado. Hey, that's right. Get the juice to the They don't need it. Uh -huh. Hey, bank. Don Get Drake, it gone, buddy. out. Gets eight. There you go. Ah, I see you go for it. What happens, right? For Don Drake, <laughs> go for the gown. That's okay. Right back on the head, buddy. Two nine for Corrado Pony. 68. 68 is the lead. John Drake to finish up the first string. Box number 10. One more string to go after this. One more match after that. Both balls are off. Head pin there. Punches out the half twister. Right. Monty going with a spare. Punches the head pin. Too accurate. Good right, Ben. A six box, 94 finish for Don Drake. Not happy with that. Sometimes it just doesn't go your way. Seven for Pani. He ends up with 96. So two boxes to go in the first string. Justin Scally on the left, Al Nelson on the right. 69 pin lead. Universal screening over all play. Again, both the outside looking in for a playoff position. Now Nelson from Augusta Maine working on a spare. He has 80 in the ball to eight. And hooks the 10 pin. 81 now for eight. Justin saw a head pin hit. Leaves the 5 and 10 discount. What I think is out of breath as it rolls back in. And it goes out of play. Sweep that five over to the ten. Justin for a spare. Oh, good try. Al Nelson needs a big out here. Five standing, one ball to go. Gets three, eight box, 89 after nine. Justin with a nine also, he's at 13 nine, buddy. Nine. 69 is the lead still. Universal screen. Dominating the screen. Can all play bounce back in the second? Justin just needs four pins to beat the dummy if they were playing the dummy. Dummy team has played has caused havoc, and a lot of teams has played the role of spoiler. Well, it just means you're averaging 11. That's pretty good. 11 and a half, actually. Nelson with a 7 10 split. We'll go for the wood in the middle. 111. Yeah, and he's on. Spared his 10th box, 99 in the ball. Good try by Justin. He's at 113 coming in. He's at 120 currently with the 7. Ooh. 121 for Justin Scally from Boxborough, Mass. For Universal Screening, 560 total. For Universal Nelson on a spare to wrap it up. Gets the clarity right. five pin drop. 104. 62 pin victory for. We have a substitute coming in. All play with a 498 to a 560. 62 pin lead. That's box set. And we'll get the lineup changed in just a minute for you. 
You're watching the U.S. Invitational from Lee Delanes in Ashford, New Hampshire. Paul Grant with Bob Lee. This is our second string coming up here. We have one more match to go. Four on Tuesday, five yesterday, and five today, and more tomorrow. And the playoffs will start later in the day after the team competition ends. Wrapping up Saturday, both days starting 9 a.m. at the U.S. Uh, Invitational. No, there's nothing now. We're subbing Joe Newbert in for Rick Pomeroy at the one. Yep, Joe, Joe Newbert will be leading off. And then I'm subbing in Bob Allard. Bob Allard. Where? And he's going to end up in the four slot for me. Bob Allard? Yeah. I don't want to say, but I haven't sat yet this week. So. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Thank okay, you. so two changes for all play coming up. Joe Newberg will lead off, and Bob Hallett will go on the fourth spot, replacing Dom Drake. Bowlers need a break sometimes. Can't bowl every box, every match, all week long. Got to stay fresh as much as possible. Anthony Iannuzzi will start for Universal Screening at a whopping 136 in the first. He starts off with a seven. First ball and a gutter ball with Joe Newbert filling in. Have to reset. Newbert the spin, nudges and gets it. Wood kicked over. And his first box for the second string after that 136 first. This will be the second ball. That should have been his first shot. We come back oh. after the gutter ball. It's eight. Five and seven left up. Joe Newbert coming in for Rick Pomeroy. Pomeroy has a 97 in the first as Joe gets a uh, nine box to start. One pin lead early on. Off with Ross Universal. But Anthony Iannuzzi is on a uh, spare. He's from Winthrop, Massachusetts. They call him Triple T. Big fellow here, working a spare. Takes his time. Locks in, delivers. Right side, oh. four horsemen. Six fills, 16 after one. Joe Newbert, one to the right, three pins. And nine in his first box. Oh, feel the breeze off to the right. Joe left up the diamond on 35. Anthony ends up with an eight. 24 after two. And a seven for Joe Newberg filling in. 16 after two. Eight pin lead already. The universal screening after the first bowlers. Uh, five bowlers on each team. Two at a time going two strings for the match. Steve Bonte on the left on the right side at 100 is first string from Lynn, Massachusetts. League average of 112. And it's a change also. That's Bob Allard. He's born second actually, that's why he's born fourth. Okay. They changed him around from the fourth spot to the second spot. So Bob Allard coming in. Steve Bonte, head pin, but gets a split. Bob sold me a set of uh, Cobras a year and a half ago. Gets four on the first ball. Bonte, a difficult shot. Did he give it over? Try to get it over, wouldn't go. Bob Allard, first boxer. Coming on after he came off the first one. But just one, five standing. Paul Dyer had a 96 in his first ring. As Bonte gets a nine. Nine after one. Bob out looking for a big out. Oh, the oh, head's only got one. Six box to start. Leads 11. Just in three boxes.
Bonte, second box, first string. Two horsemen left, 10 pin in the corner on the right. Bob Allen, trying to give his team a spark here in the second string. They lost by 62 in the first. Trying to get at least two points here. Need a monster string to get total also. Two points for a win, one for a tie, two for total. On the head pin, sweeping off to the right. Seven, a split. Bati, four plus one. Punch through. Got three of the five. Alec trying to slide it over from right to left. Only got one though. For a Ted, he gets it. He'll give him 19 after two in the second string, and nine for Bob Allard. He's at 15 after two. 40, 43, 31, is it? Yep. 12 pin lead for Universal Screening. Nobody on a mark, though, right now. Coming up for the first time in the second string is Luke Uchana on the right. Sean had a 107. He was in Chelsea, Massachusetts. On 36, off to the left, gets three. Dyer. Nine drop. Six pin standing. Good cover. I think it's touching. Both of them are touch touching each other. Oh, the 96 is for a string, gets the spare. So Paul goes from the second spot to the third spot. 10 plus the ball up to one. I don't know who the fourth bowler is coming up. They didn't tell us on the lineup change. It's probably what it's one we've seen. They're all, all everyone in the pit is uh, still playing. Radapani. Kishana. Kishana, rather. Kishana, rather. Six filled. Sorry, he gets, gets seven in his first box. Working for a spare here. Almost gets it. Left, left two. Dyer for another spare. Missed it. He got six on the fill. 16 up to one. Just denied that second one. Chana looking for a 10, missed it. Eight blocks, 15 after two. Nine for Paul Dyer, he's at 25 after two. So it's a two pin lead now, universal screening. Down, six, down 60 of the match for us right now. Cliff, Walk, Cliff Walker now goes to the fourth spot from the third spot in brawl play. Pani, fourth bowler, he dropped. Walker, look at the strike! He's he got, got it! Just an all play needs. Striking his first box, he'll have two bonus balls. Pani for a spare, only gets one. Pani at a 96 in his first string. Cliff Walker at a 107 in his first string. He's from Bridget Maine. Pani from Revere Mass with a 10. 10 after one. Two pin lead right now for Universal Studio. But that will change because Cliff Walker is on a strike. Grotto Pani on 36. Off to the left, getting four. Cliff Walker working on a strike. First ball on the head pin. Gets six. Triangle on the left. Has the four, seven, eight in the back. Ten on the right side. Pani second ball. 
Head pin hit, left the six pin. Try. He's got to play for the fill over there. Spare would be a big bonus. Oh, he's Look going, he's oh, going he for it. them all. Yeah. Got a little greedy there. 16 in the box, though. After one. Lead change. Hine, up, right baby. on for a 10. He's at 20 up, buddy. a pair of 10s and a 7 box. But Cliff up, Walker, okay, 23 up to 2. Just like that. So all players back in the lead for the first time. It's the first string. By one. 79-78. All boxes are open right now. Nobody in the mark. Anchor ball is coming up. Justin Scally on the right at a 121. Watch for our mass. Now Nelson on the left at a 104 from Augusta, Maine. Slowly moving. There it goes. Justin, first box of the second string for universal screening. On the oh, head pin, oh, 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 one. Nine drop. Al Nelson. Lemon drop. Six pin. For a spare, gets it without the wood. Ten plus the ball after one. For Justin Scally for universal screening. Nelson trying to come back and puts it in the same spot. A lemon drop plus one. Has nine standing up to two. We'll need a huge out here. Three box. Right. That hurts. Big swing with a spare and a three box. Lead change. Three up to one. Not happy with himself. Justin Scally working on a spare on his first box. Head pin hit. He gets eight. He's a half blister. Nelson trying to get back on track. He's much better hit there. He gets eight. For a spare. Go! Justin. Two in a row for Justin Scally. 28 in the ball after two. Nelson for spare. He gets it. Play a match game. Good for him after a tough three. He's at 13 in the ball. That's why he had to have amnesia in this game. 13 in the ball to two. 106.92, 14 pin lead for Universal Screening, 76 pin lead in the match. Back to the top of the order. Joe Newbert, subbing in this string. Third box of the second string is off to the left, gets three. Anthony Iannuzzi. And a spare 6 8 to start. He had 24 after the first two. Off to left, getting two. Good bid by Joe. He's up two. One and two pin. I knew that one thirty six first string. Flips it to the left, gets two. And eight box for Newbert. 24 after three. Nine, seven, eight so far for him. I knew he misses. He gets a five. 29 after three, including that spare six. But eight and a five. 29 after three. 11 pin lead right now for Universal Screening. Hubert again off the left side. For all play from Belfast, Maine. Anthony, first ball. Solid hit. Gets eight. Newbert, second ball. Much better, but missed the head pin. Coming up to one, two, and the ten. This is for a spare. He gets it. 39 in the ball at the four for Anthony Iannuzzi from Winter at Mass. 136 first string in as well. Newbert with eight. 30 
22 after four. Lead is 13 for universal screening. Second ball is coming up here. Bob Allard, all play on the right. Steve Bonte on the left from Lynn Mass. Steve did 100 the first three. And a 62 point win. On the head pin, good hit, but splits five. Oh, the two left. Went down to the corner. Much manageable now. Triangle on the corner. Gets the nine pin in the back, six ten on the right. Bati, four horse from the left side. One, two, four, and seven. It's his first spare. Gets it! Bob Valley with a spare after a struggle. 15 after two, 25 down the ball after three. The spare oh. did, won't quite go. That would try to put the two pins to go. Ball might try to salvage at least two. 10 for Steve Bonte. Let it go, buddy, bags. 20. 29. 29. Yep. After three. Yep. Nine and two tens. Bob out, working on a spare here. Good hit. Head pin. Gets eight. Has to split, but it's got some wood. He wanted that one to go in the corner. He's up to 33 now after three, after a 15 start from two. Brings the lead down to five. 35 stuck again. I didn't bring enough filler material. Camera's okay there? Yeah, as right, long as 30, 35 is in a delay. That's it. Okay, Bob. We got some filler time now. <laughs> Are there favorites coming into this championship match? Well, Any Lucky Strike was built to win. Um, they, they were leading after after day one. We haven't uh, updated our standings, but they had a four, they were up four, 43 in at 11, they're averaging 581 a game. You can see right behind them at 585 on the average. Uh, Fenway Academy, 40 and 14. But I, I heard, I heard a couple, a couple teams boasting about how they, how they took Fenway for two. Yeah, that's what you try to do here with you. If you're one of the, to make your way into the playoffs in the middle. Back to live action. Steve Bonte has the Clary leaf. He's at 29 through 3 so far. There's four clocks in the second string. After this uh, match, we'll have one more to go. Bob Allen. Spare shot here. He's got a lot of wood. And he's picking Play it up. Left. He does! Nice hey, shot! That's the Ray Bork pump fist there. Two in a row. Good for him. 43 and a ball up to four. Bonte. Oh! What a pick up! What a ball that was! 39 the ball to four, picking up the Clary for a spare. It's a high five from Bob, too. He's all pumped up now. That was a tough one. That was a, he played it on the outside there. It's a five pin lead for Universal Screening in the second. 67 they're up in the match. <laughs> it's uh, great bowling. All week long. My, God, my ball is a marginal right now. Paul Dyer now, third bowler for all play. 96 in the first string, it's a 112 bowler. Two and marks on each side of the board. Three marks actually for uh, Universal. At 15 at the two, it's a split, has the one three and the seven on the left. Dyer try to keep those two over, only gets one. Oh. Lou at a 107 is first string. Chelsea Mass. Missed that one. Seven for Paul Dyer. 32 after three. In the eight box for Gachana. He's at 23 after two. Six pin lead right now. Universal screening. 149 to 143. 
I'm 68 and a half. All gonna mark in the first, the six has a nine and a seven since then. It's a tough leave here. Machana, nice ball, gets oh. nine. Leaving up the 10 pin. Real close on that one. Ball has a three and six in the right, seven pin in the left corner. Machana for a spare. Right on it. Eight for Paul Dyer. He's at 40 up to four. Blue with that spare is at 33 in a ball up to four. Four marks, four marks to two, the advantage for Universal Screening. They're on four spares. They're up by eight in the match. All play with working on two spares. In the, in the, in the game. They Fourth got the match well in, well in hand. Fourth ball is coming up, both open. Cliff Walker. Half whistle, left side. He had 23 his first two. Here's the four horsemen right. Sure. Head pin stays for Corrado Pony. He had two tens for a 20 his first two. Nice ball! Ten pins remains. Good try. Four horsemen, four horsemen won't go. I think that's Famine that stayed up. Nine for Walker. 32 up to three. Pani with a 10. Even through three. 10, 10, 10. 30 up to three for Pani. It's a nine pin lead right now? Yes, nine for universal screening. 71 in the match. They have four spares on the board though. Universal, I mean, I'll play with just two on the board. Fourth box, second string. Ball. Wood could help him. Half whistle left for Pani. Walker looking to push that wood from the five to the seven. Getting advice how to play this. He got it! Quickly. Nice spare for Walker. 42 for Cliff. And the ball up to four. It'll help them in the story. Bowlers keep moving that five pin without knocking it down. They were down four to two in the marks. They're spare, good try. They've got two of the four. Actually, that was for a, that was for a 10. 38 now, three tens and eight for Corrado Pani, 38 through four. 177, 170, it's a seven pin lead now. Anchor bowler time. Four marks to three in favor of universal screening. Al Nelson working a spare. Justin Scally working a spare. Al Nelson the right, 104 first string on a mark. Only three. 16 up to two out of three in the first. Scally nine fill. Getting six in the lead there. 37, two marks in a row. Spare eight, spare nine. Looking for his third. Nelson hooks it too far to the left. Scally for three in a row. Uses the wood. Steals it. 47. He, sigh of relief from him. 47 in the ball. After three. Nelson. Good out. Eight in that. 24 after three. A three box spare three and eight. 24 after three. Leads up to 15 now. A lot of marks in their favor for Universal Screening. Nelson open here in the fourth box for the second string. From Lita Lange and Nasher at the U.S. Invitational. Five standing, Scally on a spare. On the ball and strike! Strike on a spare, three spares and a strike. 57 through three, 67 the ball after four, wow. Sensational bowling by Justin Scally of Box for OMS.
we've got a feel for all play. They're struggling and battling, but it's too much universal right now. Nine blocks, 33 up to four for the end, Al Nelson. So 216 to 190. So, uh, right now it's 26. 26. Yep. But they're on four marks. This is two for all play. Top of the order, Anthony Iannuzzi. He's on a spare. To the left, but gets four. Half push to the left side. But Joe Newbert is open. He's 32 up to four coming in. Anthony way off there. He's at 43 after four. Nice out for a nine. 52 through five for Anthony Iannuzzi from Winthrop. Drive that spare, it won't go. Wood wouldn't turn around. No. That was for a 10 anyway, not a, not a spare. Eight for Joe Newbert. He's at 40. That was just that was just eight so far. First five boxes. 40 after five. He has grown to 31 right now. For Universal Screening. Iannuzzi, open air going to the six. Has been hit. As the four on the left, the five in the middle, the ten on the right. Joe Newbert, four horsemen, right side, the one, three, six, and ten on 35. Iannuzzi had a 136 first strength. This is for a spare. Why not? Just missed the object pin. Trying to Newbert, squeeze it in. Punch one. Uh, do, you, do you go for the ten here on thirty-five? You go for the short two. You bowling. Oh, you got to go. You got to go for the two. It's, it's situational. Uh, going for the spare, you always go for. Uh, you go for the uh, head pin, but it, on the third ball, unless you unless you need the three pins so badly, uh, you got to you got to take two for the team. Both balls get eight forty-eight. Six for Joe Newberg, 60 for Ian Uzi. 237 to 206, 31 pin lead right now. But a bunch of marks coming up at Universal. Two spares and a strike. Two spares coming up for all play. Steve Barty. Three in that fill. He's up to 42 after four. He just can't seem to get a break, so that fills. Bob Allard. He too was in the bonus, so. Uh... Nice take by Steve. 46 after four for Bob Allard after three fill. Monty, third ball, field goal, eight box, 50 after five. Ballard, eight box, 54 after five. 248, 217, 31 is the lead for universal screening. Now for 93 in the match. Bati, half whistle left. Six blocks in the second and final string of this match. Back door action. The Allard is at the 1-7. That probably goes off the left side of the wood. Bocci trying to work on the half whistle gets five. He's up to the four seven and the five in the middle. Allard, one seven. Can you pick it up? Nope. Missed the head pin, won't come, won't come back. Needed that one. Bossy on his third ball. 
trying to get at least two here. Does his job, gets a nine. Puts him at 59 through six. And to the left goes Allen for a nine. He's at 63 after six. 257 to 226, 31 pin lead for Universal Screening. And still 93 in the match. Third bowl is coming up here. Lou Gachana on the right. Off seven first string. 115 league average out of Chelsea. Bowls in East Boston, the league. Paul Dyer on the left side for all play. Gachana on a spear here. Gets the Clary for a five fill. 38 after four. Good first ball for Dyer. Has the split. There's some wood maybe to help him. Kachana gets three there. This is for a spare. Oh, 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 oh. Nice shot by Paul Dyer, the 7 10 with the help of Wood. Kachana gets a nine. He's at 47 through five with that spare. Paul Dyer's at 50 to ball. His second mark, 3 5. 35 is the lead right now, though. Well, oh, hold on. Yep, you're right. 35 the lead right now for Universal. That's Street. right, because Lou, Lou had the spare fill. Trying to get seven there on the spare. Dyer trying to get the eight. It gets the ball. Eight on the spare. 58 through five. As the six ten on the right side. Kachana for a spare. Oh, missed it. This one oh. missed it to the right, got the 10 pin, left the six, standing. Third ball for Kachana, 10 bucks. Third ball for Dyer, 10 bucks also. 68, 68 for Paul Dyer, 57 for Lou Kachana. Three, six. Lead is 27 in, favor in this game. For Universal Screening, that's 89 in the match. Corrado, Corrado Pani. On the right. Sp spare fill for uh, USA. For all play. Five on a spare is Cliff Walker here. You get that right? Yep. All right, you got six on that, 48 now. So that brings the lead down to 21. Pondy's got some favorable wood here. Can you take advantage? Oh, oh the ball went yeah, just on, behind the seven pin, wouldn't go. For another spare, missed it. At the four horseman. Pondy for a 10. Has He's it. got it. Brings him to. Forty-eight after five. Lead is twenty-two. Walker with the nines at fifty-seven now. Two ninety-one to two sixty-nine. If you're keeping score at home. Money is six blocks of the second string. Just walk. Clary lane. Clary lane. If you get him one, maybe he'll use it. But <laughs> Walker, you don't want one. Half was I tried yesterday. You need to sit down. You need a chair. Can't see ruin his voice. Bonnie <laughs> punches the head pin. Cliff Walker trying to work this out, puts it in the hole. I hate when that happens. The least favorite shot of mine is personally is, is, the, is the half whistler. Nine blocks for Bonnie. 57 to 6. A tough four. Cliff Walker, 61 at the six. Frustrated with that. That's a five point swing there. Keep it on that head, Gal. 300, 273, 27. Yep. Is the lead right now for Universal Screening, 89 in the match. Justin Scally, the anchor. For Universal on the right. Oh, he is throwing a great ball. so good. He's got wood to play with. He's on a strike here, too. Good ball by Al Nelson. Chance for a spare. Scally going for the spare on strike. Can he pick it up? He does! Oh! Spare on strike. Just putting it where he wants to. And he's throwing it. Throwing it a little extra harder than I seen him throw. Spare, spare. 
Oh. Spare, strike, spare. 87 the ball up to five. Incredible bowling by Justin Scally for Universal Cleaning. Nelson for a 10 box. Gets eight, he's at 41 after five. Lead increases now. 39 the lead right now. Scally will add to that. He's five for five on Mark so far on the head pin. Gets seven, we'll need some help there. Got some wood though. Nine, what's he doing now? 94 after five, sensational. 94 after five. For another spare. Oh, oh my goodness. goodness. Get out of here. Oh, what a try that was. That was a 94 half, by the way, for yes. Scally. Oh, my goodness. On pace for a 188. Nine. It goes the perfect game, but 103. What a start! 103 after six boxes for Justin Scally from Boxborough, Mass. Now Nelson with a 10. He's at 51 through six. That makes it 45. Universal dominating yep. now. 45 pin difference now. Thanks most much of that to Justin Scally. All boxes are open now. Nobody is on a mark. Universal cleaned up pretty good. They had four marks that time. Top of the order now. Joe Newbert. All play. Matt Worcester. Oh. Now Uzi gets the Caleri. Newbert at, 40. Newbert, Newbert at 48 coming in after six. Ian Uzi at 60 after six. Gets the hard one out of the way. That's the full horseman right. One, three, six, ten. Mm. Newbert with an eight. 56 after seven. This is for a ten. He gets nine. 69 through seven for Anthony Ayanuzi. Of Winthrop Mass. At 136 in the first. Joe Newbert. On the head pin this time. Uh, Tough lead. It's a good cross half there. Blister in the 7 10 of the corners. He'll have to earn this one for a spare. Ian Uzi on 35. Off to the right, but gets 7. 1 2 in the 10 in the corner. Good try. Wouldn't go. Canoe Pick this up for a spare. He got it! What a shot that was! One, two, and ten for a spare. 79 in the ball after eight for Ian Uzi. Eight for Hubert. He's at 64 through eight. 48 is the lead right now in building. One spare advantage for Universal Screening. Bob Allard. He needs some pins in a hurry to have a chance for two. Total is out of reach now. Back door. Five. Steve Bonte on the head pin. Gets the ten. The ball. Has perfect <laughs> wood. Four and seven on the left. There's double barrel wood behind the, the head wood to take there. Yeah, but it's Allen. Now just one pin in the back. One piece of wood in the back. And he goes in the gutter and missed it. Eight box. Updated score in just a minute. There it is. There it is. 67 now after seven. Allen for a 10, gets it, 73 up to 7, 363, 317, 46 is the lead right now. And then on one bonus ball, 
Yeah. Right, change, our, back up again. change our graphic. Eighth blocks now for both these bowlers. The second and final swing of this match. We'll have another match after this. Off to the left. One just three. Bonte. Off to the left. He gets a little more. He gets five. Tough lead though. But the one, the seven, the eight, the five behind that, and the three pin. Gets a bunch. Bob Allen has the one, four, seven, and the nine pin in the back on the right. This is for an out. It's eight, 81 after eight for Bob Allen for all play. Steve Bonte, 67 after seven, 75 now after eight. 371, 325, 46 is the lead in the string. And they've got a ball in hand also for Universal Screen and over all play. All Dyer on 36. Belfast Maine. On the right for a 10 pin hit only. Blue Kajana off to the left gets four. Dyer Max. The second ball gets five. Has the one, four, seven, and nine remaining. Kachana. No. Has the one four seven left. This is for a ten. Catch. Oh. Good hit. Gets eight. Seventy six after seven. Eight for Gachana. Sixty five through seven. Still forty six pin lead. Three seventy nine. Three thirty three. Universal spinning in total control. Hundred eight up for the match. Dyer with the Caleri. Here's Luca Chana. Nice hit, but he has a split. Tough piece of wood. Dyer trying to get a spare out of this. Missed it. Got the hard one out of the way. Five standing still. Who has the three and six with a piece of wood in front? Seven pin on the left. Oh! Hey! Shot. That was incredible. 75 and a ball after eight. Oh, tough. Paul Dyer with a rough seven there, no luck. 83 through eight. The win has been taken out of its sails. All played. Fighting hard, but it's been all universal, universal screening. Three forty to two eighty nine. Fifty one pin lead. They've all thrown about twenty five games in the last two days. <laughs> Cliff Walker gets three in the first shot. Is Rado Pani had pin needs a triangle that would may come out of play. We'll check that in a sec. Punch is two on the right, left side right, thirty six. What appears to be in play. They got a double check it. though. You're watching the U.S. Invitational, the World Series of Kendallpin Bowling here at Lita Lanes in Nashville, New Hampshire. Team competition. Paul Grant along with Bob Lee. We'll do this again tomorrow, 9 a.m. and Saturday, 9 a.m. Board Nerd Network and other ones involved also. Facebook. It's in play. He held up his fingers about five inches apart. It's Oh! Didn't go though. Good try. It did. It bounced funny. Walk with a difficult lead for an out. Left the 1710. It's the fifth time we've seen that today. Won't see him chew at it though. Three converted on the 19 in the last three days in the 1710. Connie with a 10 at 67. Seven box for Cliff Walker. He's at 68 through seven. Leads up to 52. Walker, the yeah, strike, it's work. nine. Half whistle left for Pani. Oh. 
past it. Connie to the right, leading up four, has the one. Four, seven on the left, ten pin on the right corner. Ten box Walker and an eight box Papani. 78 for Walker through eight, 75 through eight Papani. 50. Walker obviously frustrated. Guys are trying, just not getting the breaks, not getting the hits. Justin Scully wants to see if he can put up a big, big, uh, big number here. I've heard, I heard someone, someone's been in the one fifty, high one fifties. I'll check on that while. Uh, Chestakov had a one fifty three on Tuesday. He had five marks in a row, four spares and a strike, and then he had an open box for a nine. He had ninety four for five, one hundred three three six, and he has the full horseman left. Al Nelson trying to get a spare here. Five and seven. Gets oh. it by Al Nelson. This is for a spare. Oh, oh the seven won't budge. And that wood's coming out of play. 61 and a spare ball. Al Nelson from Augusta Maine coming up. The 110 average bowler had a 104 in his first. They need a couple of doubles or so to have a chance to win this string to salvage two points, but it's not looking good right now for all play. We've got a tough week. Just 12 points coming in to this match. This is for a 10 for Justin. He gets it. 113 through 7. 417 to 367. That's a 50 pin lead. Universal screen, 112 in the match. We'll get at least four pins, four points. Nice spare fill, eight on it, but a split. Scally trying to get on the mark board again. Three, six, ten, right side, seven left corner. Now Nelson, that eight fill, 69 through seven, but he has the four on the left, and ten on the right with no wood. This would be amazing if he can pick it up. Good try, punched it out. Scally trying for a spare. Got the seven to go, but the three pin remains. <clears throat> Open his last three boxes after five marks. Nine for Al Nelson. 78 through eight. The nine right, for Scally. 122 through eight. 426 to 384. 42 pin lead. And bowlers will change sides again. Final two boxes of the match. Anthony, Anthony Iannuzzi from Winthrop had a 136 in the first. He's at 64. Correction, he's at, uh, on a mark now. He's at 79 in the ball. Joe Newbert's at 64 through eight. He's on the left. On the spare fill. Gets eight, gets the lucky bounce. Good ball there by Newbert. That's the half Worcester plus one. That spare fill, he's up to 87 now. And Uzi, and he gets another one. Two in a row. 97 in the ball after nine. Nice spare for Newbert. Joe picked it up. <laughs> he's like, I got one. Good for him. 74 in a ball after nine. 50 pin lead still. Universal screening. Both on the mark here. Iannuzzi punches the half push to left. Two box, two fill rather. 99 through nine. Five fill for Joe. 79 through nine. Anthony punches out. He's got three left. Four left. One, four, seven, and the 10 on the right. 247 on the left for Newberg. Oh! Nice out, he gets nine, ends up with a 108. Yeah, nice 10 for Joe Newbert. 89 for him. Way to go, Nazi baby! 
136 to 108, 244 for two strings. Way to go, Jacuzzi! Hi, buddy, big! Holding really well there. Second bowler is coming up here. Second bowler is coming up here. Steve Bocci on the right from Lynn Mass. Had 100 in his first string. He's at 75 through 8 right now. Bob Allen on the left had 90 uh, in this string for the first time. He's at 81 through 8. Both boxes open here. Only one mark on the board for Luka China. The Universal Cleaning coming up next. It's a good ball for Bonte. Nine drop. Seven pin remaining. Allen, first ball, nine box, second string. Wow. It's the one, two, four, seven, nine, and ten in the back. Bonte for a spare. Oh, oh found, a, found a spot between the wood and the pin. Something I would normally do. Off the head pin, gets the one in the back. Got the nine pin. Five left with one to go. Bonte for a ten. This time gets it. Easy on the third shot. 85 after nine for Steve. Eight box. For Allard, he's at 89 for nine. 465 to 414. 51 pin lead. Universal screening. We're 18 and 54 coming in. They'll bring them up to 24 and 54 if it holds up. No, it's been a score split. correction. It's 48. 48 now the correction, okay. Allen punches through, only three. Bonte with a three, six in the right, seven to the left. Gets the two. Can't get the seven to go. Allen, this would be something if you can pull this one on for a spare. Oh, spins around. Good idea, but didn't go. Ten pin was wiggling and wobbling, won't fall. Four remaining, one ball to go. Bonte looking for a 10 box here. And he missed it to the right. He finishes with 94 for the string. He has 100 and a 94, 194 for the two. Allen with a nine. Finishes with a 98. 474 to 420, it's a 54 pin lead. And to make matters worse, Luka Chana is on a spare coming up. You're not mad that they out of the string yet. Oh, the recess, the pins fall down. 35. Paul Grant with Bob Lee. Thank you for joining us. You're listening to and watching the U.S. Invitational from Lee to Lanes in Nashville, New Hampshire. The Super Bowl of Caleb and Bowling. No Canada this year due to COVID. Usually it's called the Worlds. On the spare, it gets three. 78 after six, after eight, get China. 78 after eight. Head pin hit, gets eight. Leaving up to five and 10. For Paul Dyer. For all play. Get China. The comeback, leaves up the head pin. This is for a spare. He oh! Nice pickup. Five pin into the 10 for a spare for Paul Dyer. 93 and a ball after nine. Nine of the 10, he's at 88 through nine. 487 to 430. 57 pin lead. They won the first by 62. Pichana off to the left, gets six, seven. Up to the one, three, and six. Dyer on the spare gets eight. 101 after nine. 
the one and two pin up there. Chana, eight after two. It'll be in double digits. This is for another spin. Oh, oh. a little bit too far outside the pin. And he, nine for Luca Chana ends up with a 97. He has a 107 and a 97, 204 total for two for Luca Chana from Chelsea Mass for Universal Screening. And a nine for Paul Dyer, strong finish, 110 for him. He has 96 in the first, two string total of 206 for all play. Four boxes to go, two bowlers. 196 to 447, 49 is the lead officially. It's Bonnie, it's the four horsemen left. Nobody on the mark right now. Cliff Walker has the one two for a spare bid. There it is! <laughs> Praise be! Oh. Cliff. He's like, you gotta be kidding me. 85 in the ball it, for Corrado Pani from Revere Mass. <laughs> 10 for Cliff Walker, 88 to 9. 506, 457. Looking for a plus fill here to get over 100. He's 500. 85 in the ball here, coming in. That's what he needed. Nine drop. 94 to 9. Cliff goes to the right. Cliff's two. This is for another spare for Pani. Gets it. 104 in the ball. In the 10th box. Cliff just playing out the string here. Five left, one to go. And eight box ends up with a 96. Four sixty-five, sixty pin lead. Pani in the spare with seven with a one eleven now. One ninety-six and a one eleven for a two oh seven total for two. In the last two boxes for the match, Justin Scally on the left had four spares and a strike. He's pulled on the last three. He's at 122 for eight coming into the last two here. Well, that's Next another five. mark. Seven drop for Al Nelson. Scally for a spare. Oh! Twice he's been denied that seven pin. He saw 149. In Springfield, last match. Ten for Scally. 132 after nine. Nine. For Nelson, 87 through nine. Wayne Springfield at 149. He was 74 half in the last match and got 75 in his last four for 149. And then Steve Reno Jr. came back with a 144 of his own. Justin trying for his air here. Good try, won't go. Nelson going for a spare here. Won't get it. Justin's final ball of the match gets a nine, ends up with a 141. 94 half, 141, nothing to sneeze about there. Great, great job, Paul. <laughs> Universal wins six nothing, and we'll uh, take another break and uh, be 80, back. Eighty seven. First of all, for uh, Al Nelson, he had a uh, one ninety one for the two. All right, let's wrap this one up and see him back in about five minutes with game fourteen. That was a ninety five on on his last one. Okay. <laughs> now we'll sign off. Ninety five. Okay.